Hey, welcome back to the channel again. We are doing yet another review. Uh, this time, another shotgun. Gotta love shotguns. Um, this is what you call the Joe Biden fa favorite shotgun. I'm just messing with you. I can't stand that old coot. Anywho, well, I guess if he has a change of mind, a change of heart, and decides to treat Second Amendment people like we're human beings that can be trusted with firearms, I might change my view on the guy. But, till, till then, he's the old Lost Dementia dude. So, let's get with it. Uh, this time, it is the oldest gun in my collection. Around from 1925, I'm going to say. This is the Riverside Arms Company, which was from Chicopee Falls, Massachusetts. This is a long gun, by the way. Very long. It's like a 28-inch 20, a barrel. Double barrel, that is. Okay. It's a very simple to operate gun, and it is easy to disassemble for cleaning purposes. I cannot tell you how easy this gun is to clean and take apart. It is in magnificent shape. Uh, these things go from anywhere between $500 to $1,000 depending upon its condition. This is a 12 gauge. Double barrel. Easy to use. Okay. Move this knob right here. Ta-da! It comes down. Load your two shots in. Close the breech. Fire blindly into the night, as somebody once said. This is all you need to scare away a, bur a burglar. I'd rather take my chance on keeping my Glock or my stick close by. But this one, it's a really nice gun. I mean, it's a good bird gun if you're going out bird hunting. I think I've used this for shooting clay pigeons, actually. It works pretty good for it. I mean, yeah, uh, one shot, two shot, and you're done. It's on safety, by the way, if you can't tell. The safety is right here. When you don't see the S, it's on safe. When you see the S, it's on fire mode. But, it is a 12 gauge. Now let me show you how easy this is to take apart to clean. You can literally do it in less than 20 seconds if you're really good at it. First, come up here. See this thing? We are going to oh, lay it down first. But you're going to take this and pull up on it. Comes off easy, goes back on easy. I swear you're not going to break it. But just pull up. That's that part. Which also has the serial number on it, which I'm not going to show. But let's just say it's a very early serial number. Very early. Once you take that off, it's going to look a little bit like this. And then, you're going to come up here. You're going to move this to the side. And it's going to come apart. Now it is in three pieces, easy to transport. See, this barrel is a long sucker. Now putting it back together, just as easy. I mean, it. you put the little hook on there. Okay. Clicks into place. Next, you take this and you're just gonna well, maybe make sure it's locked in there. It's gonna be right here. This is gonna be right there. That locking mechanism. 
Now what you're going to do is you're going to squeeze a hold of this and it's going to snap back on. Now it's ready to go. See? Easiest gun to disassemble ever. Uh, it's a really good shooting gun. I've never had any problems with it. It's got no cracks. I mean, it is in superb shape. A few scratches, but nothing major. Nothing that's going to affect the value. Uh, but this is a 12 gauge, and they were originally designed back in 1915 uh, during World War One. Actually, these guns were, um, after World War One. the R Riverside Arms Company was investigated for war profiteering, which means they, they were making a lot, a lot of money off of people profiteering during the war, which is supposed to be a crime, but ever since, you know, Halliburton and, you know, the military-industrial complex came along, People's been profiteering on war for a long time, so that's nothing new. Um, this is a nice gun. I mean, it's the oldest one in my collection. And I definitely give it two thumbs up. I mean, it's a good from a good functioning firearm. I don't shoot it a lot. I mean, I shoot it, you know, whenever I go out shooting clay pigeons or, you know, if I want to go bird hunting. But yeah, I mean, if you got any questions about it, you know, don't don't hesitate to ask. Um, if you would like to see a certain firearm, you know, we can try to pull some strings. We know a lot, a lot, a lot of people, it's got a lot of different guns. So, you know, if there's a gun you'd like to see, you know, we can try, try to make it happen. Um, but we're going to be doing more reviews and... Hopefully, uh, some of you out there still find find those ten subscribers. Gives you ten bucks. Actually, you know what? If you're watching this one, let's make it twenty. Okay. If you've been watching, let's make it twenty. Let's raise the stakes a little bit here. Ten subscribers, twenty bucks. So for about ten minutes of your time, to ask ten of your buddies to subscribe to this channel. And they have to stay subscribed. Then you get it. Sound good? Sound like a deal? Alright. Well. As we always say. God bless you guys. And God bless America. Thanks.